Good morning, my Pisceans. Happy Wednesday. Today is water sign day. I'm a little late. I like to get my readings out before 9 a.m. Central Standard Time, but do you know why I'm late? Because I got a new deck. I was waiting for it. I got word that it was coming. I bought it months ago and it was finally released. It is called the, I want to say Pennywise, you know, from it. <laughs> <laughs> it's not, but it, the Phantom Wise Tarot, it's brand new. I'm so excited. And so for the water signs, I'm using it first for you guys, the Phantom Wise. Look at this. Look how awesome it is. Got the, look at that. Not my deck at all, but I do have the link if you guys want to check it out just to get a, um, a closer inspection on it. I am a sucker for black and red. I am. There's something so cool about it. But yeah, so... But we'll see what messages are in store for you guys. So Phantom Wise deck for the main and Wheel of Fortune for the clarifying. I got an Eight of Swords and a Three of Pentacles. Eight of Swords can be a card of overthinking. Somebody's in their head and you don't, it's just, they're. I feel like they're trying, they're making it harder than it really needs to be. Pisces, this could be you. This could be somebody about you. I'm kind of feeling, honestly, it could be about you. We have a three of pentacles going on over here, and I feel like somebody might want to grow something, bring an offer to you. Um, so, oh, literally, bring an offer to you. Six of pentacles. Um, Ace of cups reverse, and then the four of pentacles reverse. Maybe you're fresh out of something, and maybe they don't know if you're ready for something else. Um, yeah, eight of swords reverse, and a knight of swords. That's what that kind of feels like, that maybe you're, you are free. Maybe you're too free. And they'll be like, I don't know, Pisces really would be interested in me. Their Eight of Swords, what is this? No, nope, it's you, Knight of Cups Reverse. Riding a bunny. Are you riding a bunny? Are you, what is that expression with the bunnies? Uh, you guys know what I'm talking about. You know, you know, are you doing some things like bunnies? You know, the sexy pexy things. Uh, maybe this person just feels like you're out of their league. Um, Knight of Pentacles and a two of pentacles, which I get very Virgo energy. I think this, you got somebody who's kind of dreaming in a dream esque of the whole shebang with you. And you're over here, <laughs> well, you're doing something like bunnies, like rabbits. Yeah, I don't know. It's almost like a childlike fantasy. I, I'm not gonna lie. I, I'm getting childlike fantasy. So I'm kind of feeling you might work with somebody with the three of pentacles. They know you, but may not really know you. You, they might know you, but you might come off a little unapproachable. Or so, or they might be shy. Because I feel a little out of out of one's league. It may not necessarily be true. So maybe they have uh, self esteem issues or different things. But I get childlike fantasies where they have this whole thing planned out. I'm going to ask Pisces out. Pisces will say yes. We'll go on 3.4 dates. Pisces will fall madly in love with me. That's when I'll propose and we'll we'll have a we'll just get married. And then Pi, you know, I think this person might have a lot planned. That's just what I'm I'm feeling. All right, Pisces, summarizing Venus. If you are what is that that wanted Look at it got away from me the four of wands. You got somebody that's got your whole life planned out and you may not even know who this person is. It's, is it a little creepy? It might be. It might be a lot. It might be a lot. King of Cups and what is this? The Page of Swords Reverse. Page of Swords Reverse might be somebody who's might be coming in. They might be coming in ready to make an offer. But I'm telling you, this, was a, this is somebody who's got a shitload of feelings for you. So they might approach a clumsy. That's what I'm getting. When somebody's got a lot of feelings, but they're trying to be cool, it might come off really awkward. Get ready for it. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Pisces. If you are a Pisces, no Pisces. Feel, a, feel like being a Pisces with Pisceans. I'm glad you're here. You could be a Pisces and this resonates. You, you could be, I wish I could be a fly in the wall though. I'm feeling that so strongly. You guys are going to be like, where's the exit doors? I need the exit doors. Okay, let's see what's going on. General energy for, okay. Look at that, temperance and the six of wands reverse. What is this card? The eight of cups reverse. Temperance and the six of wands reverse is a lack of confidence. 
I feel like this person's trying to get their confidence together, to be honest. Okay, what is this? Eight of Cups. I'm um, See, I'm getting used to this deck. It's all uphill. All uphill. Eight of Cups reverse. And there you are. Okay, so what's influencing the Eight of Cups reverse? What's influencing the Eight of Cups reverse? What's influencing the Eight of Cups reverse? I feel like you might be working in different offices for somebody out there. What's influencing the Eight of Cups reverse? Like adjacent. What's influencing different floors? What's influencing the Eight of Cups reverse? What's influencing the Eight of Cups reverse for the Pisceans? What's influencing the Eight of Cups reverse for the Pisceans? What's influencing, okay. Yep, the Five of Cups, Scorpio energy. There's that Five of Cups again, and it's also the Ace of Pentacles and the Eight of Wands. This is a person who wants to come in like Don Juan, bareback, riding bareback, with confidence, Pisces. You, me, together, Saturday night, let's go. But inside, I feel like they, I honestly feel lack of confidence here. I don't feel like this is past energy and stuck or even you. I mean, if this is you, Pisces, this might be you wanting to approach somebody and you feel like you may not be able to obtain them, but you really want them. Then, then you know where you are in this reading. But I'm really getting this is about you. Queen of Swords reverse and the hangman yeah you got somebody pulled way back trying to play all options yep full reverse really fearful to being rejected but more importantly of losing out on their one shot they feel like they got one shot on this yeah and they're not even seen okay what is the reason for the reading it's kind of like a person who's at least got their fantasies right now. But if they come in and you say no, they don't even have their fantasies anymore. I think they're afraid of having their, is that liber, I think limerence. At least they have their limerence. But if you take their limerence away, they'll have nothing. What's the reason for the reading? What's the reason for the reading? What's the reason for the reading, Pisces? What's the reason for the reading? What's the reason for the reading? It is the Nine of Pentacles reverse. What's in the past? What's in the past? What's in the past? What's in the past? The Two of Cups reverse. I'll tell you what, if this is a past energy, there's also a dual thing with a past energy, there's also, you know, it, 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 it could be a Pisces getting over a breakup, but I mean, two of cups reverse, you got the nine of pentacles reverse is feeling completely drained after a breakup, five of cups, eight of cups reverse, not willing and ready to move on yet. And there could be a dual thing going on where a Pisces is still healing from this. I'm still getting the strongest is somebody working up the courage. What is on Pisces' mind? What is on Piscean's mind? What is on Piscean's mind? What is on Piscean's mind? The Six of Swords reverse. Energetically not ready to maybe move on from this. Whatever the what whatever you, you got out of. If you left someone or they left you, you may not be ready very interesting because right there we have you we have what's lost and we have what's new and you may not even be aware what's new but i'm telling you the new energy's got it all planned out they just need the courage six of wands to come in what's in the near future what's in the near future for the piscians what's in the near future for the piscians What's in the near future for the Pisceans? What's in the near future for the Pisceans? It is 
the Devil Reverse and the Ten of Pentacles Reverse. I think this is you releasing this, the Knight of Cups Reverse and the Death Reverse and the Page of Swords. I think this is a whole death process. I won't lie. This is a whole death process. This was a big, big moment or a big relationship, a big connection, a big whatever this is in your life. This is you really, really letting a, a maybe the, it was just a big connection in your life. And you, that may be why somebody else is keeping themselves in the, the foreground because they know <coughs> that you need this space because I'm telling you, you got somebody back here in a page of swords. What's below that? And the page of cups reverse. So yes, yeah, somebody's trying to be patient. And I feel like a rabbit, a nervous energy. They're being back here waiting. Is Pisces ready? Is Pisces ready? Is Pisces ready? This person's got a lot of freaking feelings for you. I feel like you might work with them. If you don't work with them, you probably live near them. You know this person. This isn't someone I don't think online or anything like that. Four of Swords reverse. And we got here the Ace of Cups reverse, which is a delay. And the magician, I feel like, yeah, the magician and the king of pentacles, I feel like this is a person who, I still feel like you work with this person. They're just waiting. I feel like they're biding their time for you to be ready because you either went through a divorce. If, this is big. This isn't like something that just started and stopped. This is a divorce. Um, this is something that you are taking a, a lot of time to really get over. But man, somebody is like got your next relationship all planned out when you're ready so six of wands three of pentacles and the four yeah when you're ready four of pentacles reverse here and ace of cups reverse which i feel is a delay okay what is this the eight of cups reverse and the five of cups influenced by the five of cups for the piscians eight of cups reverse influenced by the five of cups pisces and scorpio and you know what we're missing is the queen we're missing the queen. I feel like the queen left and that's why we're sad. It's like maybe the queen left with somebody else. Two of swords, which is the queen of swords and the nine of swords. Some of you could have got cheated on or, or feel like abandoned um, starting over. What is this? The eight of cups reverse, three of swords there and the temperance trying to heal a broken heart. Eight of Cups reverse and the Five of Cups, influenced by the Five of Cups. Eight of Cups reverse and the Five of Cups. What is that? And the Five of Swords reverse. I get secret on that. I get secret on that. Why do I get a secret on a Five of Swords reverse? On the Nine of Wands and the world. I think somebody's just waiting nine of wands until you're ready to get your eight of wands back out there to, on the world three of pentacles reverse and the king of pentacles reverse until you're ready i feel like some of you this might be a, honestly a divorce situation there's your queen of pentacles and a king of pentacles that's why i say that and a judgment waiting for something to be signed and ready and then a page of pentacles and death card there and they're just over yeah but man the pisces i i don't really what I'm tapping into, I don't think you are aware of this person's feelings, though. I think you'd be surprised. Are you interested is another question. Would you be interested? Five of Swords Reverse tells me I don't think you're aware because the way this card looks, I feel like you might, I feel like you know this person, but you may not pay attention to them. I feel like they... I, it's like when your back is turned, you know, this might sound really creepy, but when your back is turned, I think they watch you. That might sound creepy to some, but, or to everyone. <laughs> That's like the basis of most horror movies, but in a romantic kind of sense, but, the, but when you might look up, they might look away. That's what that kind of feels like. Actually, Five of Swords, that was reverse. I do feel like they're they're not any I don't think they're confident when it comes to rushing in on top of you probably not being ready at that 
But I'm telling you, man, I think you're the one for this person. They know that. Five of Swords reverse. Why the Five of Swords reverse? And the yeah, Page of Pentacles reverse. But they know you're not ready. I really feel like they're okay holding on to the fantasy. I think the big what they're worried about is going in too soon, and they don't even have their fantasy left because you might crush. You know, once you get rejected, you don't even have your fantasy left anymore. What is the Nine of Pentacles reverse reason for the reading? Nine of Pentacles reverse, Virgo energy. Nine of Pentacles reverse. Nine of Pentacles reverse is a card of very self-focused, self-care right now. It's hyper-focus of oneself. Why is that? Yeah, Ace of Cups reverse, you're healing yourself. Knight of Wands, until you're ready, this person, I feel like this person's got patience, Page of Swords reverse, Seven of Cups, okay, I don't want to complicate it here, okay, Ace of Cups reverse, and the Knight of, I feel like you're just honestly, to not complicate it, I feel like you're filling your own cup here, Ace of Cups reverse on the Knight of Pentacles reverse, I think you just were done, done in by whoever recently, through a divorce, could have got cheated on, could have lost a lot in a, in a connection or in a marriage. Ace of, and the, maybe dating is the last thing on your mind right now. Ace of Cups reversed and the Nine of Pentacles reversed and the Nine of Cups, look at the two nines being reversed. They're not even upright. So that means the cycle's not complete with you yet. You're just hanging out in your little hangman state, just healing. And I think this person knows that. What's the Two of Cups reversed in the past for Pisces? What's the Two of Cups reversed in the past for the Pisceans? Two of Cups reversed in the past. You thought you got Mr. or Ms. Wonderful and Perfect, and it just wasn't. What's the Two of Cups reversed in the past? Or it changed into something else, into someone you didn't even recognize anymore. What's the Two of Cups reversed in the past? Yeah, Page of Cups right there. So maybe this person might be somebody you would talk to on the day-to-day, -day, a friend, about this connection. And for them, that's where something grew out of this. For them, they looked forward to these conversations. Page of Cups. Why the Page of Cups? And the Two of Cups reverse, Page of Cups. Page of Cups for the Pisces and the Lovers Reverse. Yeah. It was like, a Page of Cups to me is always hope. It's the hope of, especially after something falling apart, the hope of something better. Pisces, that makes me think, if you know this person, you may have thought of it too then. Because I, I'm getting the coloring cards are more a lot of your energy and the lover's reverse feels more of your energy. And the page of cups makes me almost think that you may have thought of this, of them. But maybe you thought maybe they're, you know, you're not ready or, or they may not be interested. Ten of cups reverse and the devil reverse. For some of you... Oh, that popped in my head like that. This could be a friend of this, your spouse or the, the friend of the person who did this to you. All right. What is this? The Six of Swords Reverse. Aquarian energy on your mind. The Six of Swords Reverse. What? This is my first time seeing that card. It looks like a 1912 ship over here. The Six of Swords reverse. On your mind, Zena, I don't know. Energetically, I don't know if I'm ready. Knight of Pentacles and the Death card. Getting your toe, put your toe out in the dating waters out there. Death card, Knight of Pentacles. Okay, on your mind, Six of Swords reverse. On your mind, the Six of Swords reverse. Why is that? As six of swords reverse maybe on your mind you think you're not ready but when I clarified it death card in the knight of pentacles 
I feel like this also is a person like who's really interested in you, Pisces. They would take it as slow as you need it to be. Uh, what I really get, they're afraid of you just flat out rejecting them. They feel for some reason that they only got one shot. They, because I feel that they feel you're already out of their league. And if you, if you see what they see, you know, like, I know this sounds complicated, but right now the fantasy is, is there's somehow a possibility if they, they could get you and they really could make you happy and maybe they really could. And this is all alive and well in their head. But if you sit there and flat out tell them no, they're the ones living in the reality of these cards, of the Nine of Pentacles reverse and the Ace of Cups reverse and the Nine of Cups reverse and the Lovers reverse. It's kind of like those movies where it's like a thriller. Like what was that movie like Motel, I don't know, that John Cusack movie where it's like a thriller and it all ends up being in the guy's head at the end, which I really hate those movies. But that's what this feels like. In the end, it's going to be in this person. I, I just feel like you got somebody who really, for some reason, they feel like you're out of their league. At the same time, I feel like you're going through something, you're healing, and they're willing to give you that time and space. And they really need to work on themselves, it sounds like. They need to work on their confidence. Okay, these cards. We got the Devil Reverse and the Ten of Pentacles Reverse which is Capricorn. I feel like you got somebody in the near future trying to control your money. Yeah, hangman. And I feel like this is part of it too. Maybe you're afraid of, that's part of the two six of swords reverse, is which would be a 12 of swords reverse if there was such a card, which would break it down to a three of swords reverse. Because if it looks like you're dating too soon, if this was a divorce, you might have somebody who, be, who might not want to pay for something because they might think that you are cheating or not, not that it matters because if they owe you money, they owe you money. Or if they have to pay child support, they have to pay child support. It doesn't matter if you're dating or not, but you know, sometimes people are assholes and they will withhold things that they should be paying for because they feel like they can. It happens all the time. And so I feel like some of you are really pulling yourself back because you're afraid of this devil energy that you dealt with in the past. This is a complicated storyline. There's two different things going on at the same time. Okay, hangman, hangman, hangman. Maybe it's just, and the five of cups reverse. It's not that you're emotionally still tied to the past energy. You just know what a bastard they are over the pentacles. And you want to, you want what you're owed. And the flip side, you got somebody crazy over you. And maybe some of you Pisces are open because now we do have a death and a Knight of Pentacles. Over here, we have a Page of Cups. So some of you Pisces might be open to this person. If you are open to this person, be tread lightly, okay? Tread lightly regardless because this person is crazy over you. Do you know that? They are crazy over you. If they're not saying it, they are. I'm here to tell you. I'm revealing this person's secret. They're crazy over you. They just don't want you to know it because they don't want you to like think they're crazy, which they are over you. So yeah, I think so you're going to, I don't know what to do. I don't know what you should do with that. That's going to be up to you and you know what to do. I think you're, you're playing it safe over here with, with the X over the pentacles, which you probably should. But yeah, that's what I got for you for a small little weekly read. This ended up being pretty complicated. But good luck with this one, Pisces. I think you got you got a good one here. You got somebody who is I don't I don't know. It depends if you really like that, this kind of this kind of fella or feller. Um yeah, so, but this person's got the whole thing planned out. All right, my dears, have a fantastic rest of your week, and I will got, see you guys soon. Take care.